Hello, hello, you guys, and welcome back to my channel. You guys, look at my makeup. Doesn't it look super cute? I didn't contour my face today because I feel like it makes me look older for some reason. So I kind of just did everything else except contour. I think I added a little bit of bronzer right here, but there's nothing wrong with that. So you guys, I really just want to talk about this comment that I got in my last video about orchiectomy and erections. It really has nothing to do with the video itself, but I just want to answer it very, very quickly because I think it's something that a lot of guys kind of, you know, go through and they have that little thought in their head. But anyways, so this person by the name of Portals of Madness asks, I'm a young straight male, however, I find myself attracted to trans women, sometimes is that normal? I'm gonna answer this really quickly and say that yes, it is normal to like trans women as a straight male because you are straight, you are attracted to femininity, you are attracted to women, and trans women are women, they are feminine, they present, identify, and navigate the world as women. So it's really not uncommon for you to find us attractive. Um, I mean, a lot of us are kind of attractive, you know? You know, not, not to toot my own horn or anyone else's horn, but yes, we are pretty sexy and we are pretty hot. And a lot of us are extremely beautiful. So no, it's not really uncommon for you to be attracted to trans women, whether or not they are pre-op, post-op or non-op, meaning whether they've had the surgery downstairs or they haven't, that is completely unrelated because it's not like when you go somewhere and you find a woman attractive, you know whether she has a vagina or not. So I really think it's that simple. I mean, it's not really something to make, you know, into some complicated topic. I think that, um, if you are attracted to cisgender women, um, then you're going to be attracted to trans women as well. Um, that's just my opinion. Take it with a grain of salt if you want to. Everyone is different, but I don't think that it's uncommon. I don't think that an attraction to trans women is gay or even considered bisexual in any way, shape, or form because, again, they are women. They identify as such. That's how the world perceives us, and I'm sure if you saw, you know, a group of cisgender and transgender women, you would probably find all of them attractive because they are all women at the end of the day. So, I just wanted to get on here and answer that question really, really, really quickly and really simply because I don't like complicating things. It's just what it is. Um, and I think that you're just attracted to women. So yes. And I also want to say thank you to everybody who commented and liked and just interacted on the last video about orchiectomy and erections. That video got quite a lot of views and it really makes me happy to, you know, hear people comment that it, you know, helped, um, the information that I presented help them. Again, I'm not a doctor, you guys. I don't know um, whether or not you'll be able to experience erections after an orchiectomy. I was just sharing a little piece of my experience. Again, take it with a grain of salt if you want. Do your research. Do what's best for you. Do whatever your heart tells you to do. Um, I just wanted to share that information on my experience and see who it helped. So, um, but thank you everybody who watches these videos, who's liked, who's commented, who's subscribed. Thank you so, 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 so much. This video and these channels are really just to help people get an insight and it's really just for me to share my own thoughts and um, to pass along some information. So anyways, look at this makeup again. You guys, it's so cute. Oh my God. I have this Morphe eyeshadow palette. They're like $25. They're fucking awesome. But anyways, thank you guys so much. Love you. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.